Treehouse of Horror 32 is the third episode of season 33, as well as the 32nd episode of the series. In the opening sequence, the hunter kills Fumper and chases Bambi and his mother. Bambi, thinking his mother is killed, becomes worried. However, Bambi's mother appears unharmed and they kill the hunter. As they start eating him, a fairy, Maggie, appears and creates the title card Treehouse of Horror 32. Bong Joon Ho's This Side of Parasite. In the parody of the 2019 movie Parasite, the Simpsons secretly live in a rich man's basement to escape their flooded, rundown house. Kirk discovers them, and Sideshow Mel explains the gory allegory. Kirk then stabs him with his bone, sparking a fight. During the battle, Mr. Burns is nearly shot, Smithers is stabbed, and Mr. Burns is beaten to death. The next morning, everyone is found dead, and Maggie slides down the bodies. Nightmare on Elm Tree In a parody of A Nightmare on Elm Street, which honestly is probably one of my favorite horror series, Bart's scary stories drive Lisa and Maggie to hide in their parents' bedroom, interrupting Homer and Marge. Fed up, Homer starts chopping down Bart's treehouse, but tires and passes out after a few chops. A thunderstorm animates the tree, which kicks Homer for trying to chop it down. The tree stumbles upon a drive-in showing Groot from the Guardians of the Galaxy and attacks people for laughing at him. He then discovers a farm with a sign about chopping down trees for Christmas. Disgusted, he animates other trees and wooden objects, including a baseball bat. Homer and the citizens of Springfield prepare to fight the trees, but the trees spread pollen, weakening the humans and causing groundskeeper Willie to accidentally saw off his arms. Random, I know. After the trees kill all the humans, they dance around the statue of Jebediah Springfield. Homer briefly regains consciousness, but he's knocked out again by the wooden bat. Now, I was surprised with this little interlude. I wasn't going to cover this because I didn't want to ruin it for you, but let me quickly break it down because, you know, it's just an interlude. Vincent Price reads Maggie a bedtime story about Bart's mischievous antics through throughout the year, with each month highlighting a different prank or trouble he caused. From January's earthworms in waffles to November's human jerky, Bart's behavior is consistently terrible. Before Price can get to December, Maggie strangles him and then spells RIP before going to sleep. Dead Ringer. Dead Ringer parodies The Ring and TikTok. Sherry and Terry tell Lisa about a party she wasn't invited to, where they watch the cursed TikTok that kills viewers after seven days. Sherry and Terry die in front of Lisa. Bart reveals he didn't watch the TikTok, but Milhouse, who was his bouncer at a party, watched it eight times and is then stabbed by eight invisible knives. Bart and Lisa investigate, getting Grandpa to watch the TikTok and describe it to them. The video in Dead Ringer resembles the VHS from The Ring. Lisa and Bart question Principal Skinner about it, but he dismisses them. Them. They turn to groundskeeper Willie, who recounts the legend of Mopey Mary. She jumped into a well and her body remained there for seven days after Valentine's Day. Willie found her body and covered the well to conceal it. Lisa then watches the TikTok and receives the ominous message, seven, seven days. days. Frustrated, she challenges the phone operator to kill her immediately, but is humorously left on hold. Mary emerges from the television and Lisa befriends her by giving her a valentine. Lisa becomes overly clingy, even writing a song for Mary, who eventually retreats back into the well. The episode concludes with a teaser for Treehouse of Horror 33 and a last minute appearance by Kang and Kodos before their credits roll. If you want to see another Treehouse of Horror episode then click this video right here.